Okay, so today I just want to share a pretty cool exercise. Sometimes you come across a line that you really like and you want to incorporate some of the elements of that line into your playing. One option is to incorporate the notes, but we could also analyze the rhythmic characteristics of the line. So this exercise deals with getting those rhythmic elements into your line. And I'll show you kind of one way that you could practice this. And the more examples you do like this, the more you'll incorporate that rhythm into your own playing. Okay, so let's let's start with analyzing a line. So this is a line I came across. Carter Arrington played it in his True Fire course, Tactical Improv. In this lesson of his course, he's working on two bar phrases. So that's the rule. And he always starts the two bar phrase with the root of the chord. So here's the line. Okay, so I dig that line, and I especially dig the rhythm that he's using. He's not using anything other than pentatonic notes, really. Maybe a B natural in there, but everything else is pentatonic. Uh, G minor pentatonic, because we're thinking G7 chord or a G minor chord. Mostly a G7. And so the exercise is to just kind of swap out his notes while keeping all of the rhythm that he's using. Like I said, it doesn't matter what notes you pick. You want to pick many variations. Try to find notes that you like that would fit that rhythm or try to find just random notes. Play chromatically. Play one note. It doesn't matter. You want to just do many, many examples like this so that that rhythm becomes ingrained in your mind. So here's one variation. This one I'm sort of thinking Dorian, right, over a G minor 7 chord. So here's the example. Okay, so let's do that slow. In this example, I land on the 11, which over a G minor chord, we know that's the note C. Here we go. Okay, so that line's slow. Okay, our variation number three over that G7. This time I'm thinking Mixolydian, just all the notes that are in Mixolydian. And I'm thinking of a sequence, you know what a broken third is. Okay, so I kind of use those ideas. And I also use some enclosure ideas. So here's that example, Mixolydian sequence and enclosure. Okay, let's do that one a little slow. promised here's our bonus idea using some alt notes again you want to try all sorts of different notes try diminish try one note try chromaticism so here's the alt scale and as you remember coming out of melodic minor okay so we've got okay slow So there you have it. There are some ways to extract the rhythmic elements of a line that inspires you and trying to make it your own by substituting different notes.